and welcome to Monkey Island Special Edition 2, Checks to Revenge. I'm super excited to play this game, we just finished the first one and it was so much fun. Uh, I don't I really hope this one's really very similar. Well, 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 Guy Brush Threepwood, you do turn up in the strangest places. Uh, hi, Elaine. Uh, do you think you can help me out? How did you get into this mess? It's kind of a long story. Oh, that's okay. I've got time. Uh, well, it all started on Scab Island. Some of my admiring fans had pressured me into telling my LeChuck evaporating story once again. Deep in the Caribbean, Scab Island. It's very similar to Melee Island. So I bust into the church and say, Now you're in for it, you bilious bag of barnacle bait. And then LeChuck cries, Guybrush, have mercy! I can't take it anymore! I think I know how he must have felt. Yeah, if I hear this story one more time, I'm gonna be crying myself. Don't you have any new stories? Well, actually, that's why I'm here on Scab Island. I'm on a whole new adventure. Growing a mustache? No. Bigger than that. A beard? <laughs> no, I'm in search of treasure. The biggest treasure of them all. A treasure so valuable and so well hidden that it haunts the dreams of every pirate on the seas. You mean... Big Whoop? None other. Then why'd you come here? There's no treasure on Scab Island. Well, I didn't know that before. Now I'm trying to charter a ship and look someplace else. When I return, I'll have riches galore and a whole new story. Or you'll have died trying. Either way, we won't have to hear about the Chuck anymore. So they were asking to hear about the Chuck. Ha! Those guys wouldn't know a good story even if they paid 50 bucks for it. When I find Big Whoop, I'll become a legend among pirates for generations to come. I can only charter a ship and get off this stinking island. So... Part one seems to be the same as part one in the other game. Oh, and it's got the old graphic. Whoa, I've got tons of money. Riches. 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 Dang, I have a feeling I'm going to lose all of this. Uh, let's turn the subtitles on. Welcome to Woodtick. No... Treadzer hunting zone. Treadzer. Oh, so it looks like the options are better in this. That's Oops, I think I broke the sign. I did, but I gained a shovel, which I need to dig up more treasure. Oh. Where do you think you're going, fancy pants? You bridge. ain't from these parts, are you? This is a toll bridge. You gotta pay. No, I wanna keep my money. I don't pay for nothing. I'm a pirate. Tough guy, huh? Oh, no. Help! Please! <laughs> Scream as loud as you want. There's no police on Scab Island. <laughs> then who eats the donuts and roughs up the transients? I rough someone needs roughing up on this island. Whoa. Hey, you're loaded. This is my lucky night. Remember, wherever you go, on sea or on land, you can't ever hide. From Lago Ligre. These people have really big heads. Tough town. I guess I should have got those traveler's checks. Oh, it's all gone. That was fast. Good 
Thrifty Dig for the treasure hunter on a budget. Let's move on. It says Woody. That's me. Oh, no, you don't. It's not a toy. It's a hammer. I love the graphics on these. <clears throat> it's a baby. Yeah. What's the problem with that Largo guy? He really goes against my grain. I'd like to make an end table out of him, but I don't have the guts. With all my tools, I'm still unable to create the one thing that could do this island some good. Like an all-night tattoo parlor? No. Like a voodoo doll of Largo Legrand. Oh. Nice apron. Are you some sort of chef? No. I'm a woodsmith, which Ugh. gives one of us an excuse for dressing funny. Burn. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? A woodchuck could chuck no amount of wood since a woodchuck can't chuck wood. Nice. But if a woodchuck could chuck and woodchuck some amount of wood, what amount of wood would a woodchuck chuck? Even if a woodchuck could chuck wood, and even if a woodchuck would chuck wood, should a woodchuck chuck wood? A woodchuck should chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood, as long as a woodchuck would chuck wood. Oh, shut up. I'd like to look around. Are we in? It. Sure thing. Look around by stealing this hammer. I'm not holding it. Oh boy, it's Buzzsaw Girl. No one touches her but me. Nice sturdy workbench. Everything's laid out just how I need it. What a cute little stool. It's adjusted to my height. It's all this back and forth commentary, that's fun. Get away from there. It's adjusted to my height. Comfortable looking chair. It's not for sale. Nice craftsmanship. I made it myself. Nice peg leg. Thanks. I made it myself. Get your hands away from there. Yeah, obviously, I can't take anything until he's gone, so let's look around. Help wanted. One week's salary in advance. Inquire below. The Bloody Lip Bar and Grill. Well, I have a feeling that I will. Need to make money. And There's no glass in the window. There. Okay. Down the hatch. Oh, this game is just so pretty. I love it. Ew, his spit was green. Boots, barkeeper, piano, advertising. Door. Hmm. Let's talk to the barkey first. I think. Excuse me. Yeah, boy. Are we underwater? How's business? It's just terrible. No one ever comes down here anymore. Why? Largo's got all my regular spook. You know, I can mix any drink there is. Make anything you could name. But I can't make the one thing that could really do this island some good. What's that? A voodoo doll of Largo Legrand. Uh-oh. You there. Uh-oh. Give me my usual and put it in a real glass.
fork over the dough or you'll be serving Bloody Marys for a week. From your nose. That's all I have. Well, you better have more tomorrow. Or we might have to move this dump to a new location. Like, say, the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Boy, you just gave him all your money? I don't want to talk about it. Hmm. I wonder what his connection is with the check. There's gotta be something. Oh. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Wanna see my scar? Depends. Is there a good story behind it? As a matter of fact, there is. It's a story of the ghost pirate LeChuck and his gruesome demise. Heard it. This is the one where he drinks too much root beer and burps so hard he explodes, right? Mm, not exactly. Frankly, I don't care much for stories that promote moderation in drinking. I do have a business to run, you know. True, very true. Uh... Grog, please. It's shaken, not stirred. <laughs> Maybe you'd like a Shirley Temple instead. I'm old enough. Look at my beard. Ah, that's the oldest trick in the book. Tell you what, I'll let you have some near grog. Doesn't have any alcohol in it, but it's just as nasty smelling and foul tasting as that stuff grown ups drink. Right on. Oh, wait. What am I saying? I just sold the last of it to Kate. Sorry. Rats. Of course, if you have some ID. Who's this Kate person you mentioned? Ah, the courageous Captain Kate Capsize. Tough as steel, sharp as nails. She rents her ship out, does some freelance pirating. Her only loyalty is to the highest bidder. Don't get on her bad side. Grog, please. I'll need to see some ID for that. I want to get all the commentary because it's so much fun. I must have left my ID in my other pants. You'll have to do better than that. No ID, no service. It reads, Jojo, appearing nightly, no cover charge. I should have listened to my mother. I should have practiced. I should have listened to my mother. Aww. I should have practiced. Look at that. Largo's been here. Uh, pick it up? I don't want to touch it with my hands. Well, it's obviously important. I'm going to have to get it at some point. Uh, let's talk to you. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Advertisement. I saw your sign outside. What's the job? Oh yeah, I really should take that thing down. Uh -huh. I hired a new cook just this morning. But if things don't work out with him, I'll let you know. Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. All right, let's go get the chef fired. Hey, hired help only. Oh, boo. Nice. Okay, so let's go from here. Let's go. There's no glass in the window. Use the window. Ah! Man, he's just like a little kid. The fire's out. So he's not a good Vicky Swassy. It's a cold potato and leek soup. Knife, okay. Sharp. Take it. Since he's obviously not paying attention. Excuse me. Don't bug me. I'm cooking. Fair enough. Yeah, it's all cans of fruit cocktail. I like fruit cocktail. I hate fruit cocktail. Take I it anyway. I hate fruit cocktail. Fine. Okay, so I got a knife. I feel like I'm gonna have to somehow... Spit in the soup. The barkeep might see me. Okay, fine, use the window. Oh, 
still have his expressions. Okay. Whoa. Go to the door. Hello. Hi. Uh, excuse me. Oh, uh, yes. Hi there. Can I help you? Hi, I'm Guybrush Threepwood, LeChuck Busting Stud. Uh huh. Oh, that's it. Doesn't continue uh, excuse the conversation. Me. Yes. Hi, I'm Guybrush. Who are you? Wally. Wally B. Feed. At your service. What exactly do you do here? I'm a cartographer. You do open heart surgery? In here? Uh, no. I'm the map making sort of cartographer. Oh. What kind of maps do you make? Every kind a pirate could need. My eyes have seen the whole world. And there's not a part of it I haven't put down on paper. Maps are very, very important. I don't want to make him mad. How's business? Terrible. No one needs any maps since no one can go anywhere thanks to Largo. How can I get off this island as soon as possible? Good luck. With a sailing embargo Largo's imposed on Scab, it's hard to get anywhere. Which doesn't help my business, let me tell you. Tell you know Largo. anything about this Largo guy? He's just the local hood. Shakes down everybody in town. Nobody comes or goes from Scab because Largo makes them pay through the nose. Yeah, tell me about it. Where's the governor's mansion? There is no governor on Scab. This is an anarchist cooperative of pirates, cutthroats, and other criminals. A haven for roughnecks and rebels like me. The only authority on this island is that bully Largo. I'm looking for some room and board. Well, I hear there's a new chef down at the Bloody Lip. And the Swamp Rot Inn has all the comforts of the sea. But I think Largo's booked the whole thing. Thanks for the lowdown. Any time. So he didn't give me a place to go, and I didn't give me any work. Do you know anything about Big Whoop? Uh-oh. Who sent you here? I should warn you. I'm heavily armed. <laughs> Nobody sent me. I'm freelance. You better not try for my files. All my research on Big Whoop is in there. Thanks for telling me. Are you looking for Big Whoop too? Well, I haven't really been able to find out much hard information. What do you know about it? I know its location is a mystery. You mean you never heard of the four men who buried it? Nope. No. Tell me all about it. Well, all anyone knows for sure is that there was a shipwreck. The merchant vessel Elaine went down in a terrible storm. Elaine? Only four crew members Elaine! survived. They the washed mayor! up on a remote deserted island. Some say its name was Inky Island, but I don't believe that. Why not? Well, why don't you believe it? Because there's no such island. Right, anyway, so you've seen everything. that's where they supposedly found Big Whoop. But what is Big Whoop? Whatever it was, it was so wonderful, or so horrible, that they never wanted anyone else to find it. So, they took the map they made of the island and split it up among the four of them. And they all went their separate ways. Okay, so I'm going to find four pieces of the map. Where are they now? Well... I don't even know their names. I'd go look them up at the Fat City Library if it weren't Fat. for this stupid Largo embargo. Of course, it could just be an old legend, but if I could just see the map of that island, I bet I could recognize the shape of the land and track it down myself. Okay, so he's gonna be a part of my crew. 
is longitude the sideways one or is that latitude? I can never remember which is which. It's so cute when you lay people try to understand geography. I could try to explain it, but it would probably just go over your head. Whatever. You know, I could just sit and talk about maps all day. Hey, me too. Is that all you do? Make maps? Well, I do some restoration work too. I paste them together, recopy them, paint little cupids in the corners, you know, so artsy bring the four pieces stuff. And put it together. Maps are very, very important. Okay, I think that's all the information I can. I'm sure they are. Uh, well, goodbye. Okie dokie. It's a pile of blank paper. Nice map. I like it too. Oh, he just took his thingy off his eye. It's probably when I have to grab his files, but where are they? Reminds me of a dollhouse I once had. I mean, my, um, sister once had. Okay. I'll have to come back to that. And this looks like a pretty good place to stop. So we'll pick it up in the next one. Thanks for watching.